welcome back to my YouTube channel. Before we actually dive into this vlog, I just wanted to take the time to say a little message to you all as this vlog was actually filmed before lockdown and I am now fully aware that we are in a UK full wide lockdown. Um, so some of you may be wondering why have I even posted this vlog, some of you may not be. Um, the reason behind it is because I love watching kind of like a festive vlogs and just come shop with me so I just really enjoy them and especially in times like these and um, they just kind of bring a little something to my day I really do enjoy diving into a good vlog that's purely why I still decided to upload this vlog just to bring a festive mood to my YouTube channel and I really do hope you enjoy it um, I hope it kind of makes you giggle makes you laugh a little bit and just puts you in the festive mood um, something to look forward to because who doesn't love Christmas? Um, I hope you are all well, I hope you're all staying positive and staying active in this time and as the legendary Troy Bolton once did say in High School Musical, we are all in this together and it's so true. So grab your cuppers, grab a biscuit and let's dive into the vlog. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you are all well. So today I am bringing a home bargains haul slash come to home bargains with me vlog a trip for food shopping and some bits and pieces in home bargains kind of like festive feels so moral of the story i was searching my pinterest um yesterday and just looking at like inspiration for wrapping gifts and decoration because we're changing our theme this year and i was just like i need a trip to home bargains to fulfill this festive feel that I've got going on right now. So that is the plan today. We are popping to Home Bargains. I am going to have a little sneak peek, see what they've got in their decoration collections, and then also have a look at like what wrapping papers, accessories. We're going all out for wrapping this year. It's pretty much it. I want some boxes. Um, so yeah, there's gonna be some fabulous, fabulous wrapping going on in this household this year so i'm really excited for that and of course if i happen to see you know the odd cleaning product and bits and pieces because you know what happens you go into home bargains you have a budget in mind and the budget just goes right out the window like it's like a thing isn't it am i the only one who thinks this i feel like i'm not so yeah we're heading to home bargains and like i said we're gonna go to tesco's and do you know the weekly food shop and that's about it really today um come back and clean as always i love good clean contrary to what my other half will say so if you're watching this i love to clean just pointing that out anywho so yeah if you are new then hi welcome i am rj i'm mum of one and thanks so much for tuning in if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe below thanks so much for tuning in again guys of course if you have instagram i do post on instagram daily as opposed to on my youtube so if you want to see what we get up to and uh, just the things that we do on a daily basis then head on over to our instagram page and give us a little check out i'll pop it up on the screen now for you God, it's like a massive fly it's an absolute glorious day outside as well um i'll show you guys i'll flip the camera around i mean it's beautiful out here isn't it it's such a sunny autumnal day a winter's day are we going with now that it's in november um please excuse the sun chairs we haven't actually put them away yet bright blue skies outside um but it's kind of got like like nice cold frosty feel to it and um, basically it's cold but it's nice and sunny um, and the other days I absolutely love when it comes to winter so yeah anyway I'm going to stop waffling and get going <laughs> I like these mugs. Them? Yeah, I like these mugs. 
Oh, little pens, some really good stocking fillers though, isn't it? Oh, you got that? Hug in a mug, I like it. And then some really cute little beanies. So we have some hats and then actual matching scarves, like little pom-poms and all. Oh my god, this is a vibe. How cute. Absolutely love this, guys. Love. And then we've got a few more little stocking pillows down here. Little varnish. Oh, and candles. I love a good candle. Candles. And it's winter wonderland. Look at it. Some winter berry candles here. And then earmuffs. I need earmuffs in my life. Walking at the moment is actually awful. So I think I'm just going to. Oh, I don't know. Thank you. I think I'm going to have to have these. Okay. I'm loving all the colourful uniforms. We have matching slippers. All the festive feels, guys. Festive feels too. So. Come and I can see all of the silver and gold accessories, which is where I'm gonna be at. Look at all of these. I mean, look at how cute those little bears and reindeers are. I feel like I might have to buy one of them. to home bargains can we just point out that i was super good i stuck to my little list i mean i might have got sidetracked with like the odd odd board of bits of things you know as you do but i didn't come out spending an absolute fortune like what i usually do i mean it might have helped that i had the pram and i couldn't actually get a trolley so maybe i should try that more often anywho we have got some really fab festive bits and pieces and also just a few bits and bobs that I kind of wanted just for general use now. There was so many different stocking fillers, which you would have seen in like the clips um, prior to me chatting away now. Um, loads of like little stocking fillers for women, men, children, loads of different bits and pieces. And there was also like a good section of toys as well in there. Um, and then obviously there was some fab festive bits and pieces, really cheap as well. There was quite a lot of stuff that was just super affordable. Um, so yeah, there were some really gorgeous bits and bobs that I did a spot. So I won't blabber much longer and I will just show you guys what I actually bought. First up we have the festive wrapping paper. Now this year, like I said before, I am doing like a gold white hint of red kind of theme. That's like the vibe that I'm going for. But also bits that I found on Pinterest, like my inspiration for this year's wrapping paper were like craft paper and then you had like your bits of string and like dried out oranges or just kind of bits of like oh like this like your bits of leaf like these kind of things i don't don't know what i don't know what leaf that is but just those kinds of ones tied into the string it looks so aesthetically pleasing um so yeah i got these star gold star if you can see gold star wrapping papers these ones are 12 meter wrap 12 meter that sounds very long anywho that's what it's saying 12 meters looks wrapping paper for 99 pence each 99 pence each you can't go wrong for 99 pence can you and then i also did get a santa claus one because i mean it wouldn't be christmas if you didn't have santa claus wrapping paper um so these ones have little santa claus elves reindeer and a good old christmas tree again the same 99 pence if you can see up close Yes, so I just thought they would be really cute. Um, and, and then I did, I was a little cheeky when I went into Tesco's, I did pick up some more wrapping paper, purely because they didn't kind of have the, like the craft paper, like the brown paper that I, I'm looking for in home bargains, which 
was a shame, but never mind, we got it in Tesco's. So, just a plain brown craft kind of paper. And this one is a four metre wrapping paper. It's definitely not as long, obviously. And then I got it to match with these little, are they like berries, mistletoe? But anyway, I thought that would be a really nice kind of like duo. I'm feeling it, guys. I'm really feeling it. And at Tesco's, I believe it was two for three pounds. So, a huge difference in price, but... I like this kind of vibe that I've got going on here. And then what I also did manage to grab in Tesco's as well were some natural bows. I mean, <clears throat> guys, are we feeling it? I'm totally feeling that. Like, how cute is that going to look? Um, so, yeah, these were, I don't know if it is. I want to say they were like one pound something each. Um, and you obviously got like a pack of two. Um, I think it'll go on like a special presence. Um, so yeah, I like those ones. And then also recyclable white bows, which I thought would be really nice with this wrapping paper, which is the craft one. And this, I'm sure they're only a pound. So, and you get a pack of six. So it's not too bad. And then let's dive into the goodies. So I did find this absolutely gorgeous tea light set. I mean, see it up close. Just to clarify, we're going back to everything that I bought in home bargains. They were the only bits I did get from Tesco's. So, yeah. So, we're diving back into the bits and pieces I got from home bargains now. Um, yes, how beautiful is this three-piece tea light set? And then, obviously, we've got little cake cones around it. And they do actually come with, like, fake lant like tea lights inside. I just thought it was so cute. And I believe this was $5.99. I mean that is a bargain so i thought this was super festive and um, so i absolutely love this and i feel like it's gonna go on our radiator cover as soon as you walk in the hallway so getting it in the festive move as soon as you walk into the house love that and then right i don't know whether this is maybe going a little bit overboard in the festive the festive feels but i just couldn't resist tea towels i mean right guys before before anyone judges how cute are these tea towels for a twin pack for like a pound are they a pound yeah i'm sure they're a pound if you're going to decorate the house and you're in your kitchen and you're baking gingerbread men and having like festive hot chocolates you need some festive tea towels and then this one has on the most wonderful time of the year and then just a candy cane print it was just it i was gonna have to buy them and then Okay, so this is just pretty much like a winter staple that you need, like a dog walking staple. Emuffs. I, I don't actually own a pair of emuffs. I know, I know. I'm 26 years old and these are my first emuffs. I'm a bit late to the game, I think, Anna. So I went for a walk the other day and my ears were super, super cold because it was so windy. Um, so when I spotted these ones, I just thought it was kind of a must have. Um, and they are the winter collection of Bean and Bargain's finest emuffs. And I think they were like $1.99. Um, so yeah, love these. And then I picked up a few little decorations here as well for the tree. So, yeah, so I thought they would be really cute to kind of tie in with the thing that we're doing this year. They're like silvery gold. Yeah. Anyway, I thought they're really cute and just to kind of place around the tree here, there and everywhere. An image from one of my Pinterest boards had bows on their tree. So I just thought I'm just going to pick some up and see what they look like. And I also did get so what else I've got some little tinsel i thought so they're like seven meter tinsels gold and silver i thought these would be perfect to kind of wrap around presents and use it in that kind of context so which is why i bought the plain craft paper because i just thought the silver one would look really nice around that you know when you like tie it and then tie it again and then make a nice little bow anywho yes i thought that would be a nice little vibe and the last little festive piece that i got from my little home bargain strip was this really really cute envelope to santa claus it's like a letter to santa claus and it hangs so i just thought it was so cute so i think this is going to get hung on oliver's door um and obviously we'll write our letters to santa claus at the first of december and then pop it in here i just thought it was really cute and this was like 89p i mean it's really festive it's absolutely love it and obviously it's got little bits of detail at the front the little stamp with a snow in um so yeah love that okay so i did pick up a few little extras um with us obviously kind of going into lockdown um which isn't the best let's face it um i wasn't a massive fan when i heard the news um but i thought 
um stay positive and just i think i'd like different things to do with oliver um which is why i did pick up and being in bargains how cute is this um so this is just color your own animal so i got the little teddy bear and then it comes with a pack of, of crayons as well and just something for us to do over the weekend together i can't actually remember how much this was i want to say it was about three pound four pound um there was loads of different ones as well i think there was like a unicorn i want to say a penguin and there was another animal in there as well somewhere <laughs> i'm sure there was but yeah i just thought these were really cute and it's just something quite nice for oliver to do so love that and then i also just picked up some toiletries you know your soaps i've got some simple soap i love the simple skincare range and then just some shower gel i got the rear docks pink grapefruit and basil shower gel i've had this before i'm sure it's this one i did have a pink grapefruit one so i'm sure it was this one and it smells amazing Ooh. Ooh. smells insane guys honest Ooh. and then oh obviously sellotape because i'm going to need reels and reels of this let's face it i do really want you know where you can have the sellotape that wraps around your wrist i believe and you can just stick and be like a wrapping machine i do want one of them but i got these uh, for now just in case and just a new hairbrush new paddle hairbrush so i would treat myself um i want to say a pound eight nine pence one of the two and then a new shower cap because who doesn't love a good shower cap? Pound 99, well, 99p for this lovely little dotty shower cap. Absolutely love it. I did have the blue one. Um, yeah, I had a blue one from, from Home Bargains as well, and I love that one. So, yes, my little shower cap, and that is actually the last. Yeah, that's everything, guys. Um, I did get some bleach, but I think that's downstairs. Nobody needs to see bleach in my festive hall, really, do you? Okay, guys, we have come to the end of everything that I got in my little festive shop. Um, that's everything I got from Home Bargains and a little bit from Tesco's as well. Um, that, like I say, there was so much more that I did genuinely love and more than likely will want and will go back and get. But I turned myself. I reined it in. I'm super proud of myself. Anyway, guys, if you like this video and enjoyed watching, then please give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my YouTube channel down below. Thank you so much for watching. I really do hope to see you in the next video. Bye.